Hey everybody, Kathy here with Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller. Thank you for joining Phil and I today. I am doing a little bit of an experiment today, but I thought I would have Phil video it just in case you want to get in on this experiment. I'm doing an 8x8 canvas. As you can see, it was done already in pink. Scraped it. <laughs> but today I'm going to put a kind of like a beigey base color on it, which is burnt sienna and yellow and it's just mixed with my Color Place house paint from Walmart, ready to use white parenthesis satin. There's nothing in my base paint. No silicone, no glue, no water. There's nothing in my blooms. No silicone, no glue, no water. So that is my base color. Now my bloom colors are going to be Titanium White by Amsterdam, Silver by Perlex. I'm throwing in Black Cherry, which is by Color Art Primary Elements. And this is Gold by Perlex. And those are pigments. The only one that isn't is Titanium White by Amsterdam. Okay. You can get that recipe in number 248 for my blooms. Yes, I'll have a link to Kathy's recipe for oh. actually for blooms and drizzles <laughs> for her paints and pigments. Okay, so we're going to flood this little canvas. Yeah, it looks like you had just enough. <laughs> yes, I did, hopefully. Well, it's just a little experiment, so if I want to just put a little bit of whiter, if I want to drizzle a couple colors, I could. But That's true. I'm yeah, going to have more than enough. This is just a baby. Now if you go like 12 by 12, this isn't gonna be enough paint to cover that. But this little one, it's just a little baby. <laughs> Hanging out it'll, it'll in stroller. Up. It'll grow up, give it a year or two. Yeah, it will. Living here it will. <laughs> okay, so I gotta just pop my bubbles. And you just want to do this pretty quick because you don't want to skin on your house paint because you will get a skin. Okay, so we're going to start our bloom now. And the other day I was itching my eye and I had a, a white eyebrow. That was not good. I didn't even know it and you didn't even tell me, Phil. When I went into the bathroom, I had a white eyebrow. Well, you managed to get paint all over different things. So Yeah. That's so what's new? Okay, this is our first bloom color, which is titanium white. Yeah, I made, um, Phil can tell you I was up here for about two hours making new pigment colors and... Yeah, you spend most of the day up here already just making colors, so now it's nice that you can just kind of have a little funsy painting to work on here. Well, God knows I'm not going outside. It's 111 here in uh, Arizona today. But next, by Wednesday, we're supposed to only have a high, I think, about 95. And it's going down to 75 at night. That'll be nice. Oh. That'll be nice. That's going to be like heaven. Okay, this is the Pearl X Silver. And that's a pigment, correct? This is a pigment. Okay. Kathy is an affiliate ah. of KS Resin and Arteza Paints and Color Art Primary Element Pigments. And you can get some nice discounts using the links in our description box. Okay, on to the Black Cherry now, which is Color Art Primary, primary elements. elements. Yes. This is really a pretty color. Yeah, I love that color. It almost looks like a Bing cherry that you could eat. It does. And next is the Gold by Pearl X. And this is a pigment as well. Ooh. 
Ooh, look at that. Okay. Now, for my cell activator, it is black, which is always my go-to. Okay. So, I have to put my abracadabra in this, everybody. But first, I gotta pop this bubble, or my abracadabra is not mm -hmm. going to do it. Okay. Here we go now. Hang on to your seat, Phil. Look at that, Phil. Yes, beautiful. Oh, that's pretty. That's really pretty. I think. Yeah, it is. I love that black cherry. Again, a little bit of the gold around the edges and so forth. I don't think there's the going to be much of that in the middle, though. No, I don't see it much. It blows it in. out to the edges. Yes, which is which is fine. Got a really nice, cool edge of black cherry and the gold. Then you've got there. I can see the silver and white has shown up too. So now we can tip it if you want instead of spinning yeah, it. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, let's try whatever you whatever you think. Well, I just think you. Well, get... you want to spin it? Uh, slowly and see what happens. Oh, we can go slow. Uh, slow, fast. I don't know. <laughs> You won't get much paint off by going slow. Well, but then you've got to okay. do something else. Ah! It's only paint. Go ahead. Do it faster if you need to get paint off. No, yeah, it's going to be fine. <laughs> you think so? Yes. Okay, well, you know. One more. I know. It's going to be fine. Look at this. Very nice. That's beautiful. Yeah, that's a beautiful bloom. Bloom. That's really pretty. I'm really liking this. Oh, this is really, really pretty. What do you think, Phil? I like it a lot. I now, really like this. I love that black cherry color. Yeah, that black cherry is very nice. And it's it's set off very nicely. Actually, the white created some cells with the black cherry, mm -hmm. and then your black cell activator really sets those off. It does, it really does. It's very, very pretty. Okay, everybody, if you like it, give me a thumbs up, share it, um, please subscribe to our channel. We'd love to have you join our family. If you are a subscriber, we love all of you very much. And um, we're trying to get to 10,000, so please help us, tell your friends, and uh, Stay tuned because you never know what we're going to do next. So until next time, everybody, see you later, alligators. Bye. Take another look at this from 3,000 feet. <laughs> <laughs> we're dropping fast, Phil. We're dropping fast. Open the parachute. I got mine open. What about you? Just jump on my back. I'll save you. <laughs>